Hello friends, today we're going to make a gorgeous prime rib roast in our Forno Venezia wood fired oven. Are you ready? Because mine is ready. I recommend having your butcher tie your prime ribs so it's easier to cook bone side down. Now rub some fat all over the meat. I'm using beef fat, but you could use standard oil. Season generously with salt and pepper. Take a big old cast iron skillet or a heat resistant pan and put some shallots, some celery, big slices of onion. Place your roast on top, bone under. For this size rib roast, you want to use a thermometer. Enter the thermometer in the middle halfway through and set the temperature to 125 Fahrenheit for medium rare. Cover loosely with heavy duty tin foil. Place in the oven. Stirring the meat at high temp, between 450 Fahrenheit and 500 Fahrenheit, you can place the door in front of the opening, but not all the way in. It will help proper initial roasting. Then after 15 minutes, when the temperature has started to drop, between 300 and 350, you can push the door in further. Beware, do not use oven door at high temp cooking, such as pizzas, or when stirring your fire. Depending on the size of your roast, you're going to be cooking for about two and a half hours. We recommend every 15 minutes to rotate the skillet a quarter turn. For the last 45 minutes of the cook, we added our side of potatoes au gratin. The meat is done, we're going to let that rest for 15 minutes. The potatoes look awesome as well. For the jus, I deglaze my pan with red wine. Bring it to a boil, reduce a little bit, add some beef stock, let it simmer, then pass it through a colander. Voila! You're ready to go to the table. It's been resting 15 minutes. Doesn't this look just wonderful? You could cut along the bones and it will make it easier to cut after. The bite for the chef. Mm. And that, my friend, is the perfect wood-fired prime rib roast.